Welcome, sleepy heads, ladies and gents, guys and gals, to Drama Sundays. <laughs> Going back to it, I know, you know, everybody knows why you clicked on this video and I'm jumping in, okay? I watched this person way back with his YouTube channel with those short clips. It was pretty, he was, he's a pretty entertaining dude, fella, you know? Um, I'm gonna introduce him in a short form of, you know, it's a short video. It's like five minutes long. I'm hoping it will be five minutes long. In a nutshell, we have Bongo Taiga. It's a reference to an anime, Bongo Stray Dogs. You can check it out. It has like four seasons. I don't know if it's got more. I could be wrong. We also, or maybe you know this person or this VTuber more from or on Twitch, specifically Twitch, uh, named the Taiga X Holic. I'm not sure on Twitter. I, I believe it was Taiga Verse. I could be wrong once again. Going back to it, this person has faced some real deep or probably troublesome matters, okay? Before he got into some deep waters of allegations by his own moderators on Discord. His moderators that moderate his Twitch and Discord. But these were accusations, allegations. The best evidence they could have was they screenshotted some Discord messages. Boo! You stink! And by the end of it, there were, all those messages were taken out of context. So in the end, Taiga is innocent. But this was really bad because before he was innocent, he was kind of mentioned by, I don't know if you know them, but I'm going to show you the clip. Is this, this Hollow Live? No, uh, Taiga is an indie streamer who, I don't know the whole story, but Taiga was added to be a uh, Oh. oh. Yes, you've, se you've seen it, folks. Nooks Taku, VTuber, before he was an anti-tuber, anime YouTuber, and now he straight up cleaned his hands. Mr. I don't own up to anything. I don't say sorry. I don't create a follow-up video. I just say that I would, but I wouldn't. I just, you know, pass it off. Okay, straight up said that Taiga is a PDF person. PDF file, okay? Nevertheless, in a big, in a video with... Charlie, come on, man. You gotta take responsibility or accountability for that. When you have a huge following, anything you say can absolutely sway the perspective of people, you know? Like, in that whole scenario, in a nutshell, he did not apologize for what he did. But I never really expected him to. It is what it is. Another VTuber right up here. That's their name right there. Once again, I'm not throwing these names out so you, you could just go out there and harass them, attack them. Don't do that. No, 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 no. Don't do that. Please, don't. Let's not stick to their level here, okay? But going back to it, right now the present, we got my boy, my gal, my, my homeboy. I don't really know him personally, but he is one entertaining fella, Taiga. And unfortunately, before this video, I believe, if I recall, his YouTube channel got booted out. It's done. It's it's deleted, yeeted over because it broke to OS. I can't really do anything about that. We can't really do anything about that. At best, we could email or tweet at the YouTube respectfully in a formal manner that, hey, can you check it back again? What was the reason why you immediately just got that ch channel destroyed, deleted from existence? And the other thing that we can help out is Tiger's own Twitter account, Tigerverse. I could be wrong. Somebody check. Uh, somebody fact check me on this. This might be a different uh, Twitter profile, but yeah. It's suspended right now, and suspensions can still be reversed. The main argument here is, by the end of the day, it's not like Tiger is the only one who's doing lewd stuff. There's a lot of people on Twitter, a lot of people on YouTube that absolutely breaks the OS. But that's another separate matter, okay? We're focusing on him right now, or her. Guy, gal, femboy, boy, him, I don't know, VTuber, Tiger. The best thing we could do is maybe tweet it out, a hashtag, I don't know, just spread it out. Spread this shit like wildfire, my man. And by the end of this, I might be wrong, maybe in the end, Taiga is actually the main villain of the story, and this video is gonna make me look like shit. Who knows, but uh, you know what, fuck it, I'm dying on this hill, either way. As far as I see it right now, the man just really enjoyed himself, role-playing, acting uh, his, as a fanboy, VTuber, you know. And there's nothing really wrong with that. What's wrong is there are some sick creeps out there that think, Hey, 
This parasocial relationship, maybe it's not parasocial at all. Maybe I can go straight up stalk this person. Yeah, you, my man, you're lost in the sauce. That's my advice. You're too deep. You gotta touch some grass. Maybe you're already outside stalking this person. Maybe you don't need to touch some grass. Maybe you need to take a fucking vacation off the internet, my man. Straight up throw your phone away. Well, not literally, but you know what I'm talking about. In my conclusion, I think Taiga doesn't really deserve any of this. Any of this shit storm that happened to him. And it's awful. Unless he proves me wrong. Hopefully not. But yeah, thank you for watching everyone. It's a short video once again. Bye. See ya.